G'day, my name is Peter Doherty. I'm a seminarian for the Diocese of Rockhampton, studying at Holy Spirit Seminary in Benio, which is the seminary for all students for the Queensland Diocese. For me, Pentecost means emerging from a lockdown. On that original Pentecost, the Holy Spirit descended upon the apostles as they gathered in a lockdown in the upper room. It was upon the end of their lockdown that so began the mission of the church in outreach to all the world. Sooner or later, the COVID-19 lockdown too, which we have experienced this Easter, will also end. And we too will begin to gather in our churches across the diocese, from Mackay to Bundaberg, from Yapoon to Longreach and beyond. Just as the apostles were not contained in the upper room forever, so too do we realise that as government health restrictions begin to be lifted, we will soon not be prevented from gathering in person as a community again in the future. This Pentecost, here in the seminary, I joined with fellow Rockhampton seminarian Ashwin Acharya and the rector, Monsignor John Grace, well known to you all in the diocese, in remembering our many friends and family from across the region. Ashwin and I remain grateful for the trust and confidence that Bishop Michael McCarthy has placed in us in the continued support of our discernment journeys. We join with Bishop Michael and all the priests and people across the diocese in praying for all parish communities this Pentecost Sunday. May, Kent, may Pentecost be for you, your families and all those you love, a time of emergence, not simply from the physical constraints of the lockdown, but an emergence from those upper rooms which prevent us from reaching out to others and which might prevent us from joyfully receiving the hands that are extended towards us. May all of us be this Pentecost, illuminated by the fire of the Holy Spirit as it descends upon us anew. And may we pray together that prayer which says, Come Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of your faithful and kindle in them the fire of your love. God bless you all.